Hello friends, I am Dr. Jimit Vargama. I am practicing as a diabetes and thyroid specialist in Lal Darwaja area in Surat City. Today we are going to talk about a condition called pre-diabetes. It is a state in which your blood sugar level is higher than normal level, but it is not high enough to be called as a diabetes patient. It is very important that you know that if you have diabetes in pre-diabetic stage or not, because if you have pre-diabetes, it increases your risk of developing type 2 diabetes. And it also known to be associated with higher risk of heart attack and strokes. It is very important to prevent diabetes before it is leading to actual diabetes when you need to take usually lifelong treatment. So this is very important. Whenever blood, your blood sugar level is higher than the normal level. So your fasting blood sugar level crosses 100, but it is below the threshold of diabetes of 125. When PBBA sugar crosses 140, but it is below the threshold of 200. And when your three months average HB1C sugar level is above 5.6, but, but it is below 6.5, then it is called pre-diabetes. But remember, don't worry. If you have pre-diabetes, you can still prevent it from becoming diabetes. So what you need to do is a healthy lifestyle. So first and foremost is, if you are overweight, you need to lose weight. Second thing, a healthy, healthy diet is very important along with regular exercise. It is the best way forward in your weight loss journey. So healthy eating means eating balanced meal at regular intervals. This will keep your blood sugar level steady and control your appetite also. You should include salads, whole grains, fruits, and food rich in protein in your diet. You should eat less fried and fatty foods and about three to four teaspoons of oil per person per day only. And also it is recommended to drink enough water rather than sweetened beverages like soda. Also, you need to consume less salt and also you should avoid processed food, tin foods and packed foods and salted meats. Very important thing for you is to exercise regularly around 30 to 45 minutes daily. And if you are taking alcohol, it is very high in calories and it may cause weight gain also and it may increase your risk of getting from pre-diabetes to diabetes. Therefore, a sensible drinking is essential. Smoking also greatly increases the chance of developing serious health problem and it is essential to quit. So I always ask my patients to go for screening for pre-diabetes if they are overweight, if they are family history of diabetes in their family, if they are having abdominal obesity or if they are having sedentary lifestyle. Go for screening. If you catch pre-diabetes properly, it is the last chance to stop diabetes. Thank you.